Hey guys, so just a quick little tutorial on how to install Android 6.0.1 Marshmallow ROM uh, on your Samsung Galaxy S4 here. So we got the, um, in this video we'll be install, we, we are going to install CR Droid ROM that comes with Android 6.0.1. It's based on Sanjumot 13 and you can also use this uh, method to install pretty much any Marshmallow ROM on your Samsung Galaxy S4. So basically, the, the this is the, the the way to install ROM is the same. So uh, to go into recovery mode, uh, first of all, first of all, make sure that you have root access and make sure you have a custom recovery installed. And if you have those two stuff, you are good to go. Uh, first of all, download the ROM and the G apps from the link down below in the description box and copy those two stuff into your phone's internal memory if you download them on your laptop. You can also download those two files directly on your phone using Google Chrome or UC browser, but uh, I recommend to download it first on your laptop, then copy it on your phone, on the root of your storage, root of your internal storage, so that it's easier to find when you are in the recovery mode. Now to go into recovery first, uh, power off your phone and hold down the power and volume up button at the same time like this and wait for your, for your phone to vibrate and let's see here okay I think I messed it up I'm just gonna remove the battery and try it again I think it's power volume up and the home button Yes, yes, yes. Hold down the power volume up and the home key at the same time to get to the recovery. As you can see, I have TWRP recovery installed on my Samsung Galaxy S4. Okay, we're just going to leave this plasticky thing here. And you can see here, first of all, no matter what ROM you are using, make a backup first, okay? It's a pro tip, make a backup first, even if you are confident that the ROM will work sometimes you will get screwed okay so make a backup first swipe to make a backup and then go ahead go back and go into the wipe section and do a factory data reset after doing the factory data reset go into the installation section here it will show you your internal memory scroll down as you can see i have my rom on the root of my storage this is the rom we have cr drive 6.0.1 uh, JF LDE XS. This is the uh, i9505. Then also I have my G apps here called as Slim Mini G apps Alpha for 6.0.1 build. So first of all, you need to select the ROM file, swipe to confirm flash. It will take two or three minutes. After flashing the ROM, go ahead, go again to the installation section, scroll down to your um, internal memory, and scroll down to your Slim Mini G apps here and click on them and swipe to confirm flash after the flashing is done go ahead and reboot your phone in system and just wait for the phone to show you the nice marshmallow so it's pretty easy uh, if you follow all these steps nicely then you won't be able to have any problem you won't face any problem it will work as smooth as butter for you and uh, and definitely I recommend uh, anyone who has a Galaxy S4, I recommend to install this CR Droid ROM. It's pretty damn awesome. It comes with a ton of features. And uh, if you really want to see all those features, go ahead and check the link down below in the description box where I put the a link for the review of this ROM where I showed all its good stuff. So you can see it's working absolutely fine. So yeah, you won't be having any problem with this ROM like boot loop or anything like that it's 100% working in working condition there are absolutely almost you know one person bugs I mean I haven't seen any bug just few bugs for example um, going uh, you know, for example there's like a slight lag sometimes sometimes but yeah I talked about this all in more detail in my ROM video review so you can check that out I'm using it it's pretty damn awesome I'm also satisfied with this battery life so far so yeah catch you guys in the next one peace out